Matt Roloff and crew had emotional season 25 finale. The season 25 finale of Little People Big World was an emotional one, both for viewers and cast members like Matt Roloff. Because of Zach Roloff and Tori Roloff quitting the show, the season 25 finale, in many ways, felt like a series finale. TLC even made sure to wrap things up nicely, including tying up a lot of loose ends just in case this did end up being the series final after all. Even though Matt Roloff said that he was open to more filming, he also made peace with things if the show does stop after this most recent season on TLC. Matt shares new retirement hobby with his followers. With Little People Big World not currently filming, many fans may be wondering what Matt Roloff is doing to fill his time. Of course, as longtime fans know, there is always work to be done on Roloff Farms. However, Matt shared something different that he has been doing to occupy his time of late. According to Matt Roloff, his latest project is organizing and labeling old photos. With as much family history as Matt Roloff has, there is no doubt a lot of old pics to sort through and organize. So it certainly looks like it's a monumental undertaking for him. Matt Roloff shares memories of old treehouse. One thing that Matt Roloff recently shared from sorting through old family pics was the old family treehouse. Along with sharing a pic of the build, Matt told his Little People Big World followers that even though the treehouse was taken down by a big windstorm, his kids were able to make a lot of memories in it before they had to say goodbye to it officially and cut the rest of the tree down. If Matt Roloff does continue this hobby of organizing and sharing old pics, no doubt Little People Big World fans will tune in for them, including all of the old memories attached to them. As much as there has been strife within the family over the years, times like these are a reminder of happier, and perhaps even simpler times, and viewers love to see it. Audrey Roloff of Little People Big World recently shared the birth of her fourth child with husband Jeremy Roloff. The couple welcomed a baby girl named Mirabella in May with fans sending well wishes and more to the former stars of the TLC series. It appears some of the social media love was short-lived, however, as Audrey Roloff is now defending her parenting skills. After sharing the news of her dream birth, the 32-year-old shared a photo of her daughter doing the dishes. The innocent pic showcased her oldest daughter Amber standing on a stool in front of the sink. Audrey Roloff, accused of using kids' chores for content and more. The image sparked some controversy among a small number of social media members. One person took a leap, commenting that her kids look better than others, while another person wrote she put her child to work for content. One social media member even went as far as to accuse the reality star of making her child do chores at too young of an age, adding let her be a kid. The image appeared to have a number of other fans angry and sharing their thoughts of how Audrey and her husband parent. Audrey Roloff. Fans wonder if Audrey Roloff is looking for attention. While Audrey shared that Ember personally enjoyed helping out around the house, the Portland native was also asked if she made her children do chores. Following some negative feedback, the mom of four has moved on, posting a photo of her new family as they all welcome their newest family member Marabella. It appears the little people, Big World alums aren't letting some negative public opinions drive them down as they continue to celebrate the growth of their beautiful family. As shared by Audrey, Mirabella's birth was intense, and an event that has changed her for the good. Little People Big World is back with another season and a new family drama. The 24th season of the show will premiere on TLC on Tuesday, November 1, at 9 p.m. ET. The new season will pick up from where it left off in season 23. The 23rd season finale of Little People, Big World ended with a tough confrontation between Amy and Matt about the latter dividing the family by not selling the family farm to his children. The divorced couple also blamed each other for spoiling their children with ATVs and letting them get away with big mistakes. Matt decided to put sell the farm and informed the kids about the same via a message to which no one responded. Tori then said that they were now disconnected from the issue of Roloff Farms. Karen and Matt went to a pottery class and were excited about enjoying their retirement. In season 23 of Little People, Big World, Zatch wanted to purchase the north side of the family's farm. 
His father, Matt, decided to handle the situation like a businessman and did not reduce the price of the farm for his son. Matt did not think any of his children could take care of the farm and believed that he would be the one taking care of the property. Zach, Tori, and their kids moved to another town after the deal fell through. They did not celebrate Christmas with their family and only visited the farm once during the pumpkin season. Matt later grew concerned about who would take care of the farm in his absence and decided to put the property on the market instead of offering it to his children. Zach said that he did not care about the farm anymore and wanted to devote his time to taking care of his pregnant wife. It was later revealed that their third child was going to be born with dwarfism. Amy and Chris went to Arizona to meet Matt and Karen, much to the surprise of their friends, since Amy and Matt were already divorced. Jack underwent surgery for his limp. Little People, Big World Season 24 will feature Zach and Tori welcoming their third child, Josa. Tori will need major surgery for the birth and fans will witness the moment she saw her son for the first time on April 30, 2022. However, trouble is not over for the Roloff family as the couple will not let their newborn meet Karen because of her insistence that Matt did nothing wrong in selling the farm. Amy and Chris will celebrate their one-year wedding anniversary and reflect back on their journey. In the trailer for the upcoming season, Karen and Matt hinted at a different family farm situation, with the latter saying, I think I've gotten the message and I am ready to do something different with the farm.